Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. In this session, we are discussing how to deploy ACR Docker images into the Azure Kubernetes cluster using Azure Pipeline. So in this Azure Pipeline, I am going to create a pipeline uh, and deploying the Docker images into the Kubernetes cluster and we will run the uh, deployments and services. So first of all, in the Azure pipelines, this is the my organization. So in the pipelines, I am going to create a release pipeline. Go to new pipeline. Before that, uh, we need a service connection. Uh, we need to cube con uh, we need cube config file to connect uh, Azure pipelines to the ACR. So let me create that. For that one, you just need to go to Cloud Shell. And uh, in this session already, we have installed the Kubernetes cluster. If you get kubectl, get nodes. The cluster is ready. To communicate uh, Azure pipelines with Kubernetes cluster, we need kubeconfig file. So one node is up and running. The default configuration file should be available under slash home, the user and dot kubeconfig. If you cd dot kubeconfig, here the configuration file should be available. You can take this config file go to project settings service connections new connection azure kubernetes kubernetes next so we have kubeconfig file pasting this kubeconfig file you can verify accept certificate its session is verified and you can give the service name like azure pipeline config sorry grant permissions all the pipeline verify and save now we have successfully created a connection once this is done we will create a release pipeline. So now session pipelines. So new pipeline. So I'm going to create a release pipeline. Create release pipeline. Create empty job. And uh, I need artifacts so I need the ML files so before that we have we will push the images uh, we will uh, create a maven builds we need tar file right so that tar file for that one before that create new pipeline classic editor so we have already service connection available. So this is my repo name. 
main branch continue maven so i need to get the log uh, whatever the files are available that files i need to be artifact and uh, publish it in the drop location so agent ubuntu latest source files copied so i don't need to build the maven i just copied the files i am deleting this one and uh, my extension file should be in tar files uh, sorry ml files so we need to copy the ml file deployment file service file so yml So drop location, so bill number, copy the files. Once this is done, just save and run. Now this job is done, source files copied, okay, now publish, consume, now this is the drop location, we have deployment file and ML file, so now you need to create a release, create empty job, Now build under build session. You just need to select source files to be copied and default version low and source files it should be copied. Azure repos Azure builds source path source files copied default version latest source files copied add and now in this stage you just need to select go to job agent you just need to select azure pipeline specification you just need to select open to latest depends on your requirement now add the task and apply into the kubernetes cluster deploy to kubernetes 
display name so first i am going to deploy the deployment files then i am going to deploy the service file deploy the deployment ml files and action is deploy the config is azure pipeline kube config namespace default strategy not required manifest files source drop location this is the deployment file okay now if you have image pull secret you just need to provide image pull secret otherwise not required now same way you just need to deploy service file to expose your service to the outside deploy the service OML file action deploy kubectl config namespace default strategy none manifest files okay this is done now save and so before that i'll show you i don't have any deployment files and ml files kubectl get deploy i don't have anything In same way kubectl get svc kubectl get pods here also nothing is there okay now the deployment files if you see this is the repo name and the devops you can session that's all and uh, now in this stage save save ok create release create release now release one has been created if you check the logs
now it is done successfully now if you check kubectl get pods the pods are running now if you check kubectl get deploy the deployment is up and running if you check kubectl services get a service is up and running now take this external ip and put the port number now list all customers see now you can you can get the output okay if you fail with uh, the deployment ml files anything you just need to create a secret if you have issue with pull the image from docker hub uh, azure container registry to the kubernetes cluster you just need to create a secret otherwise not required this is the command to create a secret okay so i already created a secret and uh, i have updated the secret the same the command is kubectl create secret docker registry this is the name registry created and this is the your uh, docker hub registry name username and the password okay and the email id and this you have to update it with in your deployment file image pull secret okay so that's all about in this session so we have seen how to using uh, azure pipeline how to pull the image into the kubernetes cluster and uh, how to deploy the deployments and services and uh, how to access the application so that's all about in this session if you like the video please share and subscribe thanks for watching bye